Hi, this is Janet, and this is my reading log for Chapter 8 on Poetry. And the title of my book is Wonton, A Cat Tale Told in Haiku. The author is Lee Wardlaw, illustrated by Eugene Yelchin, uh, published by Henry Holt and Company, LLC. Copyright date 2011. Um, it is fiction in haiku. Uh, number of pages is 32. And it's appropriate for around first, second grade. Um, Wonton. Um, I really enjoyed this book. Um, I'd never read a book that was done completely in haiku before, um, but it was really entertaining. Uh, Wonton is a shelter cat um, who really wants a home, but he doesn't want to look too eager. Um, being a cat, you don't want to look too enthused. Um, and on visiting day, there were a couple of kids that came in and one of them pinched him, and the other one pulled his tail, and he didn't want them. Um, but the boy um, that he liked rubbed his chin just the right way. Um, so he really wanted to go home with him, but he didn't want to look too eager. Um, so when he, went, when he was chosen, um, he was happy, but at the same time, he didn't want to leave his familiar surroundings so he was a little a little disturbed about that um, and it took a little while for him to get used to being in the home he wasn't crazy about the boy's little sister because she liked to dress him up in little dresses and have tea parties and he wasn't real thrilled um, and he got into a little mischief um, chasing flies and knocking over lamps um, but in the end he he uh, got comfortable um, preferred to lay on his boys socks and clothes rather than the fancy bed they got him just because it smelled like smelled like him uh, he ended up really loving the boy and the boy loved him um, I think this uh, story um, is good for kids because it demonstrates um, the use of haiku and storytelling um, I think the purpose was to entertain um, life skill um, Um, life skill for the for the story or concept um, could be how much adoption really means to animals how much they want to be loved um, my connection to the story we have a cat um, got her in 2014 um, our really good friend um, it's kind of like a grandpa to my kids he passed away um, and the girls really loved this cat and begged and begged for us to keep her and uh, I really didn't want a cat in the house but we took her and she's just become part of the family she's I've never met a cat like her she's just She's not really needy, but at the other on the other hand, she she ingratiates herself with all of us. So <clears throat> that's my connection. Um, the activity that I chose um, is to have my students um, choose a haiku from a list and then draw a picture to go along with it. Thank you.